Time for 96.7 Yes FM Entertainment News. All right, we had proof over the weekend that the internet has nothing else to do but complain about everything. They complain about everything, and they don't read into stories. They don't care. No. They don't care to know the context of of images uh. or stories or quotes. What did Jim Bob Duggar do? Jim Bob Duggar posted a throwback photo of himself along with his two kids on a trampoline uh-huh. when they're babies. He's holding the two boys who are wearing nothing but diapers, standing on a trampoline, right. not doing anything. No, just a picture. A picture. They're now 17 years old, The kids by are the 17 way. now. There's a throwback picture. People writing on, on Instagram, I don't care who these people are. It's not safe to have babies on a trampoline, blah, blah, blah. Just, just what? It just, it probably said hashtag TBT. Jim Bob, before you post on anything, run it by your publicist and your PR people first. They'll take care of the posting. Don't hit submit. Wait. Yeah. Hold on. Somebody has to prove that. Uh, Diddy had himself uh, a bit of a fight over the weekend, and allegedly he and the girlfriend had broken up. You know, it's a slow news day when we're talking about Sean Diddy Combs because <laughs> when was the last time he made music? Nobody cares about him. It, I, I mean, I guess some people do. Anyway, he is in the news now because his, him and his girlfriend got into a fight. Allegedly, uh-huh. Sean stole his girlfriend's phone to investigate some alleged cheating, uh, maybe some texts, maybe oh. some illicit photographs. Uh-huh. Cops got called. A report was made. Apparently, they did settle the thing. They break up all the time. They always get back together. So maybe uh, we'll be talking about Sean you know Diddy Combs when he has another breakup. Uh, did they check his Snapchat? Because I believe Cassie took a selfie of herself and put hashtag hack. So she was just... This is YesFN Stupid News. It was a complete and total waste of pizza. Yep. Attacked by pizza. That is the headline of this story. This guy went to uh, pick up his vehicle, which had been impounded following a DUI arrest. Yep. He comes with a pizza. Uh-huh. Gets a little and a statue. And a statue. Gets a little mouthy with the police officers there. Doesn't like uh, the cut of their jib, so he starts throwing slices of pizza and punches. And of course, that results in him being tasered and then arrested again. Throwing pizza, wasting it. No, never gonna waste eat it. It's a been pizza on the floor. Ever. You can't eat it then. Well, you can. Five second rule. Does that apply at, at impounds though? At the police station? No, Probably no. not. You don't no. know what's been on the floor there. No, lots of spit from people Bronx who are getting arrested. Like, yeah. Spitting. I don't like yeah. this. Um, <laughs> she said no to the dress, so she tried to sell it. Yeah. Uh, so this woman placed her wedding dress uh, for sale on eBay after her ex-husband left her to pay the bill for their divorce. Her listing reads: In addition to accepting inquiries about both the dress and the skank that my husband ran off with. <laughs> She warned potential buyers to dry clean the dress before wearing to, quote, get rid of the stench of betrayal. I don't even think the best dry cleaning service could get rid of that stench because betrayal, that lingers.